I'm here right now with uh, Kaylee Dimmock and we're gonna be talking about the differences between Halifax and Vancouver. We're trying not to fall onto the ground. <laughs> Let's get through this. <laughs> Welcome to Halifax, guys. <laughs> All right. Ready? All right. Okay, okay. Yeah. So this is clearly very different than Vancouver. Yes. Oh. oh my god. Oh. Are you okay? <laughs> I'm doing great. What are the key differences that you notice? Uh, between Halifax and Vancouver, oh, I've noticed so many things. So uh, yeah, the sidewalk clearing situation isn't so great here. Right. Oh. <laughs> If there's anywhere you really want to be, you just have to make it happen yourself. Yeah. You know, you have to take it upon yourself and not, you know, not get bummed out of, hey, I can't find my dream job here, I can't do this or that. I think it's about finding a way that you can implement your passion in, in your own way. I think, I think, I don't know, does that make sense? And make it work, yeah. Like, yeah, like I think like, for example, let's say that you love digital marketing and you're like, oh man, I can't find this amazing digital marketing job here in Halifax that I would really love. Uh, I think you can then look and say, well, how else can I work in digital marketing? I think, I think that there's always solutions. Of course, it's going to be much more difficult in a place like this. <laughs> you know, it's, it's really not as booming, but there's a lot of really great things about Halifax too. Like this morning, <laughs> this is pretty funny actually. I, was, <laughs> I, was go I went to the gym and I had to pick something up from the post office. And I crossed the street and then I was on my phone. I was being one of those idiots in the city, like, you know, checking your email while you're on your phone walking. And the person in front of me must have been like 15 feet in front of me. And I get up to the door of where I'm going and I notice he's been standing there holding the door for me oh, from no. like 15 feet away while I was on my phone. And I'm just like, oh my goodness, like who does that? Like, if somebody's on their phone and has no idea and they're still 15 feet away. Yeah. Like, but they still do it, they but wait for you. he still did it and he had like all these, he had like a suitcase with him and like a briefcase and I was like wow that's so nice and everybody here, like people are definitely friendlier, like strangers definitely bond together and <laughs> when I get home if I go into my building and the elevator is about 20 feet away from the entrance and you see somebody in the elevator and the door is closing. <laughs> <laughs> they don't wait for you. They don't wait for they you. Don't They're wait gone. For you. They don't, they have they don't somewhere open to it be. back up. That's, yeah. You know, and I would say only like maybe a quarter of people hold doors for people. Never gotten used to it. No. Ever since I left Nova Scotia 10 years ago, I thought I'd just get used to everything out there. But I think when you're from Nova Scotia, it's like part of how you were raised. You just think like, yeah, it's like ingrained, right? Nice. And that's the way it's supposed to be. And like, mm -hmm. Yeah, so what are the key, like if someone was saying, all right, I'm not sure if I want to move to Vancouver or on the other side. Or if I want to move to <laughs> Or to Halifax, like where, like, <laughs> like, what would be the key, like, I guess decision making points? I think career, no matter what. Career. Career has to be one. Uh, I think it's going to be a lot more difficult here, yeah. I would say, in terms of career. Unless you are a nurse or a doctor mm -hmm. or something like that. Because they're needed. Like exactly. Yeah. And, and they do need a lot more doctors here, a lot more GPs. So I think career has to be a consideration. That being said, you know, the jobs that are here, uh, there's a lot of people have this perception that Halifax pays way less than Vancouver. Yeah. But it doesn't really, really? you know? Um, especially in the marketing world from oh, those yeah. kinds of jobs. Like I've seen like, I've, I actually know somebody who lived in Vancouver, was from Toronto and moved here for a job. Really? In marketing and it paid her more than she was making in Toronto. Really? Yeah. That's a lot of things people like, people don't realize that. Yeah. They think that if they go to a bigger city, they go to Toronto or Vancouver, it's gonna be that much easier. Yeah. But I find here is a place where you could shine easier. Is that true? I think it's hard for me to really know. Like I would have to, you know, be more in the job scene here. Yeah. In Vancouver and Toronto, there's a ton of competition and a lot of people are even willing to work for free, like volunteer for a while. Lately when I visit Halifax, I tend to be staying in the North End and I find that this cafe is a really great spot to work. They're also open late. They're open till like 11 o'clock or something and they serve alcohol as well, so not, not saying that's why I come here. <laughs> You food. know, if you come at night time or I had a glass of champagne here with a friend like at two in the afternoon on oh, Sunday, yeah. like 
Not you know, bad. Yeah. So, Cafe Lara or Lara? I think it's Lara. Lara, okay. I think that's how you say it. I, 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 I,